Please stand as Mrs. Hitchens and Mrs. Benson's class leads us in the Pledge of Allegiance. And I'm JJ Bowles, and welcome to this week's Hornet Buzz. On May 5th was the principal breakfast. Mrs. Ryan chose our very own Mackenzie Green and Riley Kizu to represent Davenport at this special breakfast. 105 students were nominated from other schools and ours altogether. The Illinois Principal Association planned the breakfast. Congrats, Mackenzie and Riley. Fourth grade had Ag Day on the 4th of May. There were animals like cows, pigs, and sheep. They learned about pigs, tractors, the pork industry, and how plants grow. They learned about corn and hog slush pigs and how they get ready to be shipped to make pork and bacon. It was a very educational trip. On May 2nd, Miss Sears class did their poetry slam. Each student performed a poetry that they found and a poem they made by themselves. The children presented their poems to their fellow students and teachers. After that, they enjoyed yummy cookies and a drink. Great job, Miss Harris class. What was your favorite part about reciting your poems? Um, probably about showing them to everybody. Thank you. What was your favorite part about reciting your poems? Whipping a pop my fake test. <laughs> Thank you. Last Wednesday after school, we all, the news team, took a field trip to the WMBD News 31 news station. We, we learned about how cameramen put together packages. We watched the first half of 5 o'clock news live, and then we watched the second half from the control room, where they control what is showing on the screen. It was very interesting. We finished off the trip with some dinner at Monocle's. Mm, yummy! <laughs> then on Friday, May 9th, was the track meet. Every third and fourth grader participated either in high jump, softball throw, running long jump, or broad jump for the field event. For the track events, every third and fourth grader either did 50 meter dash, 200 meter dash, 4 by 1 or 4 by 200 relay, and 80 me 800 meter dash. The class that went first for third was Goodfield. For the f f f first for fourth grade was Miss Air's class. Great sportsmanship was shown by all. Now we are going to turn it over to Brielle with Staff Showcase. Guess who? Miss Sierra. Hello, I'm Brielle Beck, and today I will be interviewing Miss Sierra. Tell us about your family. Well, I come from a family of nine. There are four girls and five, no, scratch that, four boys and five girls. I have one little boy who's not little. He's a senior at Peoria, Notre Dame. Okay, thank you. What grade do you teach? I teach fourth grade at Davenport Elementary. How many students do you have? I have 23 fabulous, nearly perfect students. Do you like your class this year? No, but I'm on camera, so I'm going to say yes. I do. Okay. What is your favorite part about teaching? Um when it's my day off. What is your favorite dessert? 
Uh, not a picky dessert either. All of them. What is your favorite wild animal? Oh, wild animal. Hmm. I guess a fourth grader. <laughs> Besides kids? Oh, I don't know any wild animals. Um, okay, uh, a skunk. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Miss Sierra's sisters, Jack Anthony. Julian, Miss Sierra's brother. Mooney, Miss Sierra's cat. Shadow, Miss Sierra's other cat. What's your favorite season? Summer? Spring? Fall? Or winter? Summer got 117, spring got 34, fall got 8, and winter got 16. Summer wins! Woot, woot. Commercial. The Big Bad Musical is coming up on Thursday, May 29th. The play will take place at the high school. At 10.30 a.m., kindergarten and third grade will see the play. At 1.30 p.m., first, second, and fourth grade will see the play. At 6.30 p.m., family and friends will see the play. Hope you all like, like the, the play! play. Hi, welcome to Billy and Sally. It's Sally here. Today we're on a, tr a trail on the Appalachian Mountains. Hi, Davenport. It's me, Billy, and my sister, Sally. Hi. And this is our new friend, Emily. Hi. Today we are on the Appalachian Trail. Did you know hikers usually adopt names while on the trail? And did you know about two through Three million visit visitors walk a portion of the Appalachian Trail every year. And did you know the total elevation gain of hiking the entire Appalachian Trail is equivalent to the climbing Mount Everest 16 times? No, I didn't know that. That's very interesting. We come back, come back next, next time for more Billy and Sally. What is Mrs. Smith's favorite genre? My favorite genre is... A. Biography B. Folk Tales C. Fiction Or D. Nonfiction Folk Tales B. Folk Tales. Yeah! Happy birthday to author Bruce Coville. He has wrote My Teacher is an Alien. Spine Tingulars, Always October, The Monsters Ring, Monsters, and more. Bruce was born on May 6th, 16th, 1950, age 63. He likes the books Mary Poppins, Dr. Doolittle, Nancy Drew, and the Hardy Boys. His wife is Catherine Diaz. His kids were Oren, Kara, and Adam. Yeah, 
Hi, my name is Abigail Fowler and this is your weekend weather. Today will be the high of 56 and the low of 39. There will be variable clouds with passing showers. Saturday will be the high of 62 and the low of 42. It will be partly sunny. Sunday will be the high of 69 and the low of 45. It will be partly sunny. Ready for this week's weather joke? What goes up when rain comes down? Umbrella is so funny. <laughs> Calendar. Tuesday, first grade play. Wednesday, fifth grade orientation. Thursday, room 13 play. This week's birthday. The end of the end, that's all, folks. Hello, I'm Delaney Phillips, and today we are interviewing fifth graders for some questions. I'm Ryan. I'm Natasha. And I'm Kayla McLean. Okay, first question. Do you guys have pop quizzes? No. no we no, do not. No. And I'm Noah. Is it true that the food is as delicious as they say? Yes. 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 Cheeseburger and fries. Cheeseburgers. 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 Are the fries real? Yes. They taste like McDonald's. Oh my gosh. If they're McDonald's fries, I'm eating fries every day. Okay. How much time do you have between classes? Three minutes. Three? Wow. That's not very long. Are the tests harder than fourth grade? They are if you don't study, so make sure you study. And if they're multiplying fractions and decimals. <laughs> okay. How many field trips are there in fourth grade? I mean, fifth grade. <laughs> Three, Shed Aquarium, Naples, Naples, <laughs> Neighbor Settlement, and the Chiefs, game. Chiefs game. Baseball's pretty fun, I have to say so myself. Because the Cardinals are awesome. No, it's for Cubs. 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 Car Cardinals. Cubs. Raise, your Wait. Raise your hand if you like the Cubs. <laughs> Cubs win! Oh yeah, girls, high five, high five. No, because Kylie's raising for it. Kylie! You got this on Come here, Kylie! I'll, I'll high five you when we're done, okay? Okay. Oh well, she's raising her hand for Cubs, okay? We're done with this conversation. Okay. Do you have to memorize every country in the world? No, we do no. not. No. Not yet. Okay. Is fifth grade better than fourth grade? No offense, but yes. Uh, yeah. Um, I had a good fourth grade teacher, and I have a lot of good fifth grade teachers, so I don't Who know. Who were your fourth grade teachers? Mrs. Bear. Mrs. Hitchens. Mrs. Bear. No, Miss Sierra. Oh my gosh, that's heartbreaking. <laughs> she's so awesome. <laughs> she is so awesome, Noah. Okay, Ooh, let's keep going. Are the teachers at the middle school good? Yes. Awesome. You have to get on Mrs. Worley's good side. Her good side. Okay, so she has a bad side too? Yeah. It's small, but it's, 
<laughs> it's small, but it's there. <laughs> it's small, but it's there. Okay. <laughs> How much time do you guys have to eat? 20 minutes. 25 minutes. 25. Is it 25 or 20? 25. 43 minute class period. 20 minutes. Okay, Ryan's saying that there's three minutes in between lunch and recess, so it's 20. So, so it'd be 23 then, Ryan. Or like 23. Okay, whatever. We're going to say 25, okay? Okay, so do you have anything you would like to tell the fourth graders about fifth grade? Um, do you have any extra activities? Uh, yes, you can join student council and band, and there's a lot of them in seventh and eighth grade. There's drama club, too. What do you guys like to do in drama club? Well, I did the curtain. It, I guess it's pretty fun. <laughs> and what did you do? I um, was a horse. Horses are pretty awesome, I have to say so myself. Were you in drama club, Ryan? That's sad. <laughs> oh, last year? Okay. Wait, what was the one last year? Recess, yes, okay. Do you guys have to buy your own laptop? No, no but we have like computers, yeah. Chromebooks, laptops, netbook carts, yeah. And actually computers outside our classroom. Oh wow, so there's lots of electronics in middle school. <laughs> lots of computers. The teachers have their own iPads. Oh. You, get, so you get to play video games a lot. No, but you do get your own email, but it's modified, so you can't email anybody, just people in your grade. That stinks. <laughs> you can email anybody in district or just yeah, your grade? You district? Your okay. Email. Do you guys have anything extra to say to the fourth graders? Um, the intramurals are fun. There's dodgeball intramurals and volleyball intramurals and yeah. lots and lots. There's floor, ho floor hockey intramurals. Noah loves dodgeball. He's excited. I would say don't be afraid of good feeling Congaro kids. They're really awesome and the first person I met in middle school was Amanda and she's from Goodfield. Um and uh don't be afraid because like don't be afraid of like I'm gonna miss it because like all the classes are like in a row all together. So in that three minutes, you're probably going to make it to the next class, which is like two classes down. So don't be afraid of that. <laughs> so we shouldn't be scared to go there, not know where we're going and everything, right? Yeah, just follow the person you know that you're. Yeah, that if you have all the same the schedule with someone, just follow, just follow them. Follow, just follow them. <laughs> just follow the people are, that are in the same class as you. Thank you.